<laughs> All right, welcome to Bar. Um, my name is Wendy. Bar is a workout combining yoga, Pilates, strength training, low impact cardio. Um, so we'll get our heart rate up, but we will not be leaving the floor. Um, listen to your bodies, do what you can. If there's anything that gives you pain, stop doing it and change something different. Or if you know ahead of time that something's not right for your body. Feel free to do what you can do. Hopefully, I'll show you different options that'll work for you. So we're gonna start at the top of our mats. We're gonna put legs together. We're gonna shoulder roll back. Shoulder roll forward. All right, reach down, up overhead, out to the sides, and back down. So down, lift, out, down, lift, forward like this. Two more. One more. We're going to toe tap to the front. Tap, tap. So I'm saying my foot doesn't hurt. <laughs> uh, four more here. So one, three. Keep that movement going. Just lift the knee off the knee up. <laughs> foot off the floor. Somebody's got their camera. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Four more. Three. We're gonna take the right leg, we're gonna lift and lunge back. So you're gonna lift, lunge, keep it down or up. That's up to you. So back, lift, back, lift. Again, foot can stay on the floor if you need the balance. Four more like this. Three, two, staying back, right here. Sorry, down, up. There we go. Four more like this. Three, two, hold it down, hold it right here, pulse, pulse. Four, three, we're gonna open to the side, squat for two, down, up, down, back to the front for two, down, up, down, we're gonna open those arms, down, lift, down to the front, down, lift, keep going just like that. Perfect. Front. Two more. Open. Do what to the front? <laughs> Stay open here. Down. Lift. Down. Lift. We see you in a dance. Four more. <laughs> Three. Two. Hold it down. I'll sit down. 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 Four. Three, we're going to toe tap, arms to come up to shoulder height, tap, and tap, tap, perfect. Make our way facing forward again, middle. Four more, three, back to the toe, tap in front, tap in front, where we started. So we're going to go through the same sequence, other side, knee up in front, lift. <laughs> I think everybody stopped there. <laughs> lift. <laughs> so left leg, this time we're going to lift, lunge. Lift, left leg. When you get to that left leg, lift, lunge. Again, foot can stay on the floor if you need the balance. Four more like this. Three. Two, hold it back, lunge up, down, lift, <laughs> balance, down. Four more here, down, lift, three, two, hold it down this time, pulse down, oh my goodness, down, down, four, three, open, squat for two. Back to lunge, two, down, lift, down, open squat, down, lift, down to the front, down, lift, 
down, open, down, lift, down, keep it going just like that. Two more. Open. Oops, not yet. Open now. <laughs> One more time at the front. Down, lift, down, stay here. In our spot, chest is up, breathing, chin off the chest. Down, lift, four more like this. Three, two, toe tap. Oops, we didn't do it. Go on. Can't remember if I did Make our way back to the front. Isn't that sad? It was only a minute ago. <laughs> did we hold it first? I don't think we did. Four more here. Good Three, down. two, one. Yeah. Toe tap to the front. That's all right. We're going to get back there anyway. Finishing in four. Three, two, legs together. Nice deep breath in. Out. All right, we're going to turn and face our bar. No toys for to start with, just our legs and our core. All right, so our face bar. Now, if you do not want to use the bar, you don't have to if you want to work on your own balance, but make sure you're close enough. You can grab it if and when you need it because you'll probably use it at some point. So we're going to wide with your legs. Toes are out at a comfortable angle. Knees are going to follow your toes, so nice wide plie. Shoulders back and down, chest is up, two by two. So we're going down for two and lift for two. Down, so find that width that is comfortable for you. Nice wide legs. Chest is staying up, back is staying straight, yes. Down and lift, use all that time, go as low as you can, lift. Down and lift. Two more slow. Lift. One more slow. Then we're going to do singles down and up. So down and lift. Down. So control. Using the muscles. Not momentum to move. Toes are light for now. Heels have the weight. Squeeze those legs together. Glutes are tight. Add are also tight. Four more here. Three, two, we're going down, halfway up. So down, halfway, down, halfway. Four more like this. Three, two, pulsing down, hold it down, 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 down. Four, three, three right here, right heel. Lift, lower, left heel, lift, lower, right heel, lift, lower, left, lift, lower, keep going, lift, left, right, and lift, forward here, right, left, two more, right, hold that right heel up, right here, pulse, hips down, pulse, down, down, four, three, Two, switch your heels, left heel pulse. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Switch to right, four, three, two, left, four, three, two, switch, two, count, two, one, switch, two, one, switch, two, one, switch, two, singles, switch, switch, pulse, burn, breathe. Six, five, four, three. Both heels are up or pulsing down. Both heels up, down, down. Nice and control. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and heels down. Bring it up and in. Woo All right. Grab your band. We're going to go back to facing the bar. If you don't have a band at home, you can do this without the band. Just have a chair to hold on to. Band's going up around your thighs, above your knees. Facing our bar again. 
Nice to go just far enough apart to where your band is tight, not too wide, not too far outside your hips. Standing close enough to the bar that when we go in our little half squat right here, you're holding onto the bar, weight is back. If you don't have a bar at home, you can use a countertop or a chair, just don't put your weight down on it. <laughs> not the chair. Again. All right, here we go. Right leg, you're going to bring it back, tap it back, and bring it back in. Tap back and in. Keeping the band tight, back and in. Keeping the foot close to the floor, chest is up. We're staying down in that little squat. If you need to, take a little break, come out of that squat, straighten the leg, and then come back down when you're ready. Otherwise, try and keep that little squat there. That standing leg is going to burn really quick. Back and in. Hips are staying forward. Again, if this is not working with the band, you can get rid of the band. You're still going to work. Think about using that glute, the back of your leg, staying in control. Four more here. Three, two, we're going to go back. Outside corner. So back outside corner, back in. Outside corner, and in. Yes. Out, in, right to the corner. So now you've got that outside hip area. Working. Back, in, oh. That standing leg, standing ankle. Back. Again, take a little break if you need to out of that standing leg and then come back in. Four more here. Three. Two, straight to the side with that moving leg. Out, in. Hips are square and level. So that from your hips up should not be moving. Nice and steady. Standing tall, the upper body. Still have that little squat with that left leg. <sighs> Breathing. <laughs> out, in. Control is the key. Four more here. Three. We're going to put it all together. Side first. Stay to the side. Back. To corner. Sorry. All the way back. Back to the corner. And then to the side. Side. Corner. Back. Corner. Side. Keep that leg moving. It doesn't matter if you're off. Keep moving. Out and in. I don't care. <laughs> as long as you're moving, you're working. Corner. Back, corner, side, two more, corner, back, corner, one more round, all the way around, ah! corner, it's a standing leg, <laughs> corner, to the side, bring it in, oh, man. <sighs> me, all right, we gotta even things out. Other side. All right, so same thing. Again, start standing. Legs just enough, hold that band nice and tight. Shoulders back down, chest is up. We're going down in that little squat. Here we go, left leg back. Straight back, staying right there. Let's see if I can walk the bar. Back and in with control. Again, think about that muscle, keeping the hips level and square. Chin off the chest for breathing. And middle. Four more here. Four, three, two. We're going to the corner. Back corner, outside corner, yes. Corner control, squeeze those muscles, abs are still tight, back is straight, breathing, moving, shaking. Four more here, four, three, two, turn straight to the side, stay there, side. Back to the side. Perfect. Good job. Keep going. 
y'all look good. Don't look like you're struggling at all. <laughs> Six more here. You look so easy. You make it look easy. Four, I know that's wrong. Three, two, we're doing it all to the side and back. Corner, all the way back. Corner, side, all the way around. Keep going. Again, you get off, it doesn't matter. Just do that like in and out. Back. Corner, side, corner, back, corner, side, two more rounds, corner, back, corner, one more all the way around, corner, back, corner, finish at the side, bring it in and uh, you can take that band off and stretch those legs. Woo! What you gotta do? All right, band is off to the side. We're gonna grab our weights. Grab a drink whenever you need it. Now is a good time. <laughs> All righty. So we've got some light weights. We're gonna lunge. Right leg forward, left leg back. So if you need to, you come out of the lunge. Otherwise, try and keep the knee in line with your toes. Try, yes, keep your knee in line with your toes. And we're not going over your toes. Ooh, that doesn't feel good on the ankle. You're gonna keep it over the ankle, middle of your foot. Arms are gonna come straight out, palms are facing down. We're gonna come down in your lunge and then pull the elbows straight back. So extend straight, pull elbows back. So shoulders are down, chest is open, elbows are level with your shoulders. You guys have mirrors in here to look and make sure those elbows are staying up level with your shoulders. Again, control. I don't want to say reach. Extend forward and pull those elbows back. Keep going just like that. I don't want to miss anything. <clears throat> Four more like this. Three, two, stay right here. We're gonna bring those hands up, elbows together in front and open. Same thing with the legs. If you need to, you come out of your lunge and just do the upper body. Squeeze open. Again, elbows are level with your shoulders. Move, <laughs> balance. Four more here. Three, two, hold in here. I didn't warn you, pulse up. Up, up, up. Four, three, two. Bring those arms out. We're going to push up and then bring it back down. Push up and lower down. Lift. I'm trying to breathe. Goodness. And <laughs> down. Lift. Shoulders are staying down away from your ears. One arm at a time is an option, or you get rid of the weights. Lift and lower. Four more here. Three, two, down. Extend the arms out, rotate hands. So we're in our lunge. Yes, we're holding it. Come out if you need to. Rotate. Four. Three, two, stay right here. Palms are facing in, elbow or arms in, open out. In, open, soft elbows. Put the weights down if you need to, it's okay. You got a bump shoulder. In, open, in, and open. Four more here, three, Two, arms are coming down, bring them down, bring them down. All right, we're gonna bicep curl. Staying right here with our legs though. Curl and up, curl and up. We're almost done on the side, I promise. <laughs> curl, up, squeeze that bicep lower with control. Four more here, three, 
three, two, and one. Bring those legs in together. All right, keep those legs together. We're gonna lean forward. Did you hear that voice shake? Shoulders back, back is straight, arms are straight down. We're gonna row back and lower down. Row and lower. So using your back, get those shoulders a little break here. Use your back muscles to pull those elbows back and lower down with control. Ooh, pull back, lower down, pull and lower. Four more here. Three, two, pull those elbows back, freeze, push your arms straight back and lower down, push and lower. So again, the shoulders are down away from your ears, chest is open, back is straight. Slight bend to your knees, push back, lower down. Tricep. Elbows are frozen. Top arm of your body. Top arm of your body. <laughs> Top part of your arm is not moving. Four more here. Three. Two. We're holding straight right here. Pulse up. 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 We're finishing in four. Three. Two. And one, bring it down, shake that upper body out, shake the legs out, because we did it all. All right. Round one done. Your shoulder. All right. Yeah, get rid of the weight of the other Yeah, it's, it's a lot on the shoulders. What are we going to do? What did you say? The right? Left leg's going forward now. Okay. Right leg was forward last time. So left leg's forward. We're going to start at the very top, shoulders back down, chest is open, arms are out, coming down to your lunge, pull the elbows straight back, reach forward, not reach, extend forward, I don't like to say reach because we don't want the upper body reaching. Extend, pull back with control. Remember, come out of the legs if you need to. Four more here. Three, two, stay right here. Arms are, hands are up, elbows together in the front. Open, squeeze, open, chest is working. Squeeze and open. <laughs> Four more here. Three, two, hold it down. Right here, pulse up. Up, 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 last four, three, two, open those arms out, we're pushing up, lower down, push up, lower down, push, lower. Four more, three, two, we're staying down, arms extend out, rotate hands up and down, lift. And down in our lunge. Still. <sighs> Four more here. Three, two. Palms facing in. Bring those arms in and out. In and out. Soft elbows. Try and keep them nice and high. Four more here. <laughs> Three, two, arms are coming down. One, bring those arms down. Bicep curl. Lower in your lunge with your curl. Good job. Think about that bicep. Squeeze, lower. Four more. Three, two, one. Bring the legs together. Yes, I must fill over. Again. All right, leaning forward. Arms are straight down, back is straight. Pull the elbow straight back. Lower down. Pull and lower with control. Make sure you're breathing. Chin is off the chest. Airways open. Back and down. I'm 
we're staying controlled. Don't swing. Lifting and lowering. Four more here. Three, two, all those are staying back. Push your arms straight back, lower down. Push back, lower down, perfect. Back and down. So have those arms stop at your hips. Push and lower. Make sure they're coming down with control. Don't let them swing down. Back, lower down. Back and lower. Four more. Three, two, hold them back, pulse up, up, up. We're on the stair in four, three, two, and one. Bring the arms down, put your weights down. <sighs> Have a seat on the floor with your ball. I'm gonna turn sideways just so we can see you guys are gonna be far. All right. <laughs> Legs are shaking. <laughs> yep. All right, so balls go behind your lower back. Legs are staying straight up. I like this one. I don't know if I've done it here yet. So, legs are straight, balls behind your lower back, supporting your lower back. We're going to take your left leg over your right. And then we're going to turn, well, we're going to stay here first. So, chest is open. We're going to lean back. Go as far back as you can using your abs. Arms are going to come out in front. We're going to open and together. So, we're staying down as long as you can. If you need to, you bring it up a little bit higher or you go farther down. You decide, but make sure your back is staying straight and your abs are working. Now, the option is to do this with weights, but I'm we did a lot <laughs> with our shoulders already, so shoulders get a little break. Four more here. Three, two, stay right here. You're gonna rotate to the right and then back to the middle. Just to the right, back to the middle. Stay in one direction, to the right and the middle. Right and middle. So think about chest is staying open, shoulders are rotating. Make it as big or as small as you need to. Four more here. Three, two, hold it to the right. Open arms, spread together. So we're holding in that rotation. Arms are moving again. Soft elbows, as big or as little as you can make it. As low or as high as you can hold it. Four more here. Three. Stay right here. Arms are open. Bend the elbows 90 degrees. Now bring those elbows together and open. Little change, but you should feel a difference. In and open. Again, bring it up higher if you need to. You can sit up higher. You're still working. Think about those abs. Shoulders are down. Four more here. Three. Shaking. Two. And one. Bring it up. Take a second. Uncross legs. Cross the other direction. So now our right leg is over our left. Here we go. Same thing. We're coming back. Staying here in the middle as far as you can. Open wide with the arms and bring them together in front. So as you open, you should feel more work for those abs. Chest is open, shoulders down. Make sure you're breathing, chins off the chest. Four more here. Three, two, stay right here. We're gonna rotate, arms are staying still, back to the middle. Rotate, middle. Rotate, middle. Again, make it as big or as little as you need to. Think about that core nice and tight and in control. Breathing. Make sure you're getting oxygen to those muscles. <laughs> she gave up. <laughs> I give up. Thank you. I have a little crutch. You're fine. <laughs> Four more. You're just right in my eyesight. Three. 
three, <laughs> two, hold it to the side. We're opening wide and together. Open together. Open. Woo. This is not easy, I know. Second side's even harder. Open together. Open. Four more here. Three. We're going to scoop up the arms in two. Hold it. Elbows bent together. Open. Little change. More work. Control. Shake and feel as much. Stay in control. I don't know why I like this. Four more. <laughs> I like it before we do it. <laughs> Two more. And one. Bring it up. Take Ooh. that ball out. Woo! All right. <sighs> Keep your legs. We're going to lay down. Ball is going to come underneath. So we're going to lay. Feet are bent. Oh, that feels good. Just like that. Ball's going to go under your right foot. So the foot is on the right foot is on the ball. Both knees are bent. We're going to start with just the leg. So we're going to take that right leg. You're going to roll it out and bring it back. We'll roll it out and bring it back. So you may need to adjust that ball a little bit so it stays under your foot the whole time. Or under your leg at least. Keep them out. And back. Lower back is nice and close to the floor. Belly button is pulled in towards the floor. If you don't have a ball at home, you can do this without the ball. Just extend the leg out and back. I don't think it'll work with a towel. <laughs> Towels don't really roll very well. Two more like this. Then we're going to take that left leg, knees bent. Left leg's coming off the floor. Just hold it there. Same thing with that right leg. Just extend out. And back, so holding the left leg off the floor, rolling the ball with the right leg. Again, control as they're working. You don't even realize that your abs are having to work. So bring that lower back nice and close to the floor and bring that belly button in towards the lower back. Make sure you're breathing, shoulders and head are on the floor. Four more like this. We're gonna add on. You either stay here or you take that leg, extend it out. Opposite leg, straight out. So bring that leg straight, left leg straight, right leg straight. Left leg, and right leg. So both legs are moving now, or you're just holding the left leg still, or you can bring back to the floor if you need to. Lots of options here. Find what works for you. Keep moving, keep working. Lose my ball. <laughs> All right, keep this going. You need to go behind your head. We're going to add upper body. So as the ball comes in, head comes up. And then bring it back down. Ball in, head up. Bring it back down. Chin is staying off the chest. Lower back is close to the floor. As you're working again. Yes, they are. <laughs> nice and controlled. Leave something out if you need to. Otherwise, this is where we're going to stay just for another minute. Woo. Make sure you're breathing. We're working hard. Four more here. Three. Two. We're going to bring everything in and down and relax. Keep that ball there. Same foot. Same foot. We're going to switch it up and then we'll go back to that. So hands are back, back down by, by your side. Hips are going to come off the floor now. So right legs on the ball. Hips are coming up and lower back down. Hello. Lift and lower. I don't even know what to say here. <laughs> Just lift the hips and lower. Go as high as you can. So you're balancing that right leg on the ball. That hamstring. It's working hard just to hold the balance. But then that left leg has the weight of your body, more weight. So both legs are working differently, but they're all working. As they're still working, you're still keeping your abs nice and tight and controlled as you lift the hips and lower back down. You can touch in between reps, or you can just hover. If you need extra work, you will hover. Don't touch. Lifting and lowering. Oh, two more here. My hands 
We're going to lift and hold. Little squeeze up, 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 up. So those hips are getting lifted just a little bit higher. Glutes are tight. Six, five, four, three. Hold right here. Push down on that ball. Release. Push down. Release. Push. Release. Push. Release. Six more like this. Five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it all down. Grab that ball. Bring those knees in towards your chest. Give a nice squeeze. <sighs> Straighten those legs out. Reach arms overhead. Stretch opposite direction. Stretch those abs, hip flexors. Before we move to the other side. <sighs> Again, it's exciting for me to be able to flex and point my foot. Yes. So exciting. <laughs> Maybe you just um, air control. Yeah, well, air way too sometimes a better soft. <laughs> sometimes I want to soft and sometimes it, yeah, you're, but you're right. Okay. Um, we started with just roll. Okay, so balls under your left leg now. Other uh, leg. Put a thing on the right foot, a thing on the floor, hands are down by your side. Just extend that left leg out, roll the ball, and bring it back in. So we're starting nice and simple. Doesn't necessarily mean easy, but simple. Roll it out, and bring it back in. Abs are still engaged. Lower back is nice and close to the floor. Control, don't swing, but control using muscle, not momentum. We're doing four more like this. Two. We're going to bring that right leg off the floor, holding the right leg still, rolling the left leg. So just that right leg is off the floor, holding it up, left leg, rolling the ball on the floor. Remember, we're breathing. I just got really hungry. <laughs> Four more here. Three. We're going to add on again, extending the right leg as the left leg comes in. So reach one leg up, other leg up. Now, as you extend the right leg, it can go towards the ceiling or you can lower it towards the floor. Just pay attention to the lower back. Make sure lower back is staying on the floor. Make sure your abs are working. As they're staying in control, keeping that leg in control. Now, if you're ready, we're going to add the upper body. So hands behind the head, chin is staying off the chest, lifting as the ball comes in, and then out and down. Boost and out. Shaking so much. Again, make sure you're breathing. Go where you can. Feet come back down. If you just want to do the upper body, you can keep the feet on the floor and just do the upper body. The lower back is close to the floor. As we're working, we're breathing. Staying in control. Elbows are nice and wide. Head is just there for the ride. Don't pull on the neck. Four more. Keep moving. Find what works for you. Two more. We're bringing it down, both feet are back down, well, we're still on the ball, but feet are down, head is down. Left leg is still on, foot is still on the ball. We're starting with that hip raise. So bring the hips up and lower back down. Lift, left leg is balancing on that ball. Right leg has a lot of weight in it, they're both working. Try and keep your arms nice and light against the floor, using your core and your legs Legs are part of your core. Using your abs and your legs to lift and lower your hips. Again, you're touching or, or hovering. If you can hover and don't touch, do it. Add a little bit more work to that muscle. You won't regret it, I promise. Lift and lower. Again, make sure you're breathing. Two more here. 
Now we're going to lift. We're going to hold it up. Little pulse up. Up. <laughs> Ooh, that left leg is awfully shaky in my way. Lift, squeeze. You can just hold if pulsing is too much. Try and get those hips up. Six, five, four, three. Holding the hips there. Push down on that ball. Release. Push down. Release. Push down. Release. This is one of those moves where it looks like we're doing nothing, but oh, the burn. <laughs> Push, release, four more here, three, keep breathing in, two, and one, bring it down, let's get it, take that ball out, give those knees, oh, a big squeeze, release that lower back, hamstrings, glutes, and then once again, and straighten those legs, when you're ready, reach arms overhead, stretch out, at hip flexors. Ooh. All right, what's next on tap? Um, yes, side. We got five minutes. All right, side. We're going to our side. Good on the side. All right, ball off to the side. <laughs> Pick a side, any side, no ball. What we're going to do, no ball, no choice. Um, we're going to do a side plank, but we're going to play with it a little bit. So you can either stay on your elbow or you can come up on your hand. What we're going to attempt to do is take the bottom leg and lift and lower. So if you need to stay down, lift and lower. Top hand can be there for help. Or you can stay, let me see. You can just hold. There you go. <laughs> That's your other option. You can just hold, keep the knee down, and not lift, or you can go in a full side plank and just hold. So, decide what you can do. Try the lift. If it doesn't work for you, keep the leg down. Ready, sit. Find where you want to go. Again, you can be up higher if you want. Now we're going to try and lift and lower the bottom leg. So, top leg is up. Bring the hips up off the floor. There you go. And just hold there. If that's enough work, then stay right there. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> or if you want to try and come up here, find that works. <laughs> we're all struggling here. No? <laughs> okay, so we're in a side plank. We're either just holding, you can go in a full plank here on your side. If you need to stay down, lift your top, lift right there, lift the arm and leg. So decide what works for you. We're holding. Again, if you want to try the lift to the bottom leg, try it. Five more seconds here. Either holding or lifting. Four, three, two, bring it down. All right, let's switch to the other side. We'll try it on the other side. See if we can get any better. Our sides are not equal, so you never know. You gotta at least try it. So again, Let's go in a side plank. So, bottom knee can be down, elbow, hand. There's your options. You can bring the leg up and stay right here. You can be on your elbow with the leg up. You can lift and lower the bottom knee. Or if you want to stay down, lift your top arm and leg. That way you're working some of your core there. So holding, moving, find what works for you. Again, if you want to try and switch it up, you can try and switch it up. We got 15, 15. <laughs> seconds, that is, 10. <laughs> holding, strong, four, three, to bring it down. Good job. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go to hands and knees. Hands are underneath your shoulders. Knees are underneath your hips. <sighs> Suck in the toes. All right, we're gonna bring those knees off the floor and hold it for a second here. We can walk their legs out and walk them back in. And then knees back down. 
So lift the knees up, walk out. Surprise, you're in a plank. Knees back in, and then come down. Alternate your legs. If you're walking out and walking back in, switch legs. We're all there. Are we all moving? Another option is to just lift your knees, hold it, and then come back down. If you need to stay right there, lift, hold. Abs are working. Back is straight. Chest is open. Chin is off the chest. So lifting the knees, walk out, walk back in, and then bring the knees back down, and keep going just like that. So this way you're slowly getting yourself into a plank. As the legs come out, make sure the hips are staying down. You can hold it. You go in your plank, you want to hold it for an extra second or two. I'm not going to complain. Freak out. Don't freak out. Keep going. All right, do two more out and in, or just hold. When you're finished, come back down into child's pose. Hips back down, arms bend out front, relax and breathe. We're done the hard work. We're gonna stretch. I'm out of breath I get. <laughs> Alright, we're going to come back up. We're going to bring the right leg up in between your hands and sit up for pigeon pose. Stretching out your hip, your glute, your... Um, that's not a hamstring. Hip flexor. <laughs> and then bring your upper body down if you want. You can stay up if you need to. Whatever you're comfortable with. We're in the comfort stage now. <laughs> All right, come back up. We're going to switch legs. Bring that right leg back. Left leg forward. Again, sit up. If and when you're ready, bring it down. Come back up. We're going to bring that right leg forward. We're going to tuck our feet under. Come up onto the balls of your feet. And then slowly straighten your legs and roll yourself up to standing when you're ready. We're going to stand for the bar. Let's we'll finish stretching the bar. So face the bar. We're going to take the right foot back, knee down, stretch your quad. Bring that right leg back behind you, straight behind you. Push the heel towards the floor, keep the leg straight. Get a good stretch all the way up through the back of your knee. And then go ahead and bend the knee, keep the toes down, pull the heel up, and get into that calf a little bit deeper. I'm gonna bring that right leg up in front. You can either hold on to it, or you can rest on the bar. You can go as high as you can. As high as you want. Again, wherever you're comfortable. All right, open the knee out. Again, you can go on the opposite leg, keep it down, or you can go up on the bar. Leaning forward, go wherever it feels good. All right, bring that right leg back to the floor. We're going to switch left leg. Put that knee down. And then bring that back straight behind. Heel towards the floor. Knee straight. And then you can bend that knee, pull it up, it goes down. Uh, <laughs> 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 
experts, okay? <laughs> All right, we're gonna bring that left leg up in front. Again, you can either just hold on to it or rest it. We're gonna open that knee out to the side. Once again, your options bring it down on the opposite leg or up on the bar. Mm -hmm. Right, both feet are coming back to the floor. We're going nice and wide with our legs, facing the bar. Meet both hands on the bar. We're going to drop the chest towards the floor. Again, go where you're comfortable. Drop those hips back, bend the knees. Kind of go right to the left. You drop the chest down and arch the back. Oh, yes. Again, the elbows are going to get into the all right, bring those hands to the floor in front of you. We're going to walk hands over to the right, bending the right knee, straighten the left leg, get the inner thigh of that left leg. Back to the middle, opposite direction. Bring to the left, right leg straight. Back to the middle, hands above the knees, or roll yourself up to standing. Walk your feet in, shoulder roll back, shoulder roll forward. Nice deep breath in. Exhale, and we did it. Good job.